Hi, Big Tractor Power fans. This video comes to you from a freshly harvested cornfield located in Belleville, Illinois at the Renner Stock Farm, where a 616 engine horsepower versatile 620 Delta Track tractor is working on fall tillage with a 35-foot wide versatile HS350 high-speed disc. In this presentation, I would like to share with you the tractor and implements production history, specifications, and base list price, as well as taking a ride in the cab of the tractor to visit with the operator about what he likes in running this big tillage team. But first, let's head out to the field so that we can see and hear all this fall tillage action. As the Delta Track and the Fury come across the field, we can see these stalks are thick, they're hard, they're not just going to pull right out of the ground, lots of residue. Now we can look at the same ground. We've got soil worked up on top. Everything's dislodged and the soil's nice and loose. It'll really help the decay and get the ground ready for next year's crop. The 620DT tractor was introduced by Versatile on July 1, 2021 and remains a current product in model year 2024. It is manufactured at the company's factory located in Winnipeg, Manitoba. The brand first added articulated four-track tractors to its lineup in 2013. The 620 Delta Track is the largest tractor available from Versatile Currently, it's powered by a 14.9 liter, 921 cubic inch Cummins QSX-15 turbocharged after-cooled six-cylinder engine rated at 616 horsepower, and it can achieve up to 665 peak horsepower when the tractor encounters tough field conditions. It offers 1,875 foot-pounds of torque. This machine is fitted with a 462-gallon diesel fuel tank and a 24-gallon diesel exhaust fluid tank for clean engine solutions. It features a Caterpillar TA-22 full-power shift transmission with 16 forward and 4 reverse speeds, which allows the tractor to travel up to 21 miles per hour in transport. When it rolls off the assembly line, it weighs in at 58,850 pounds and has a recommended operating weight of 62,000 pounds and it can be fully field weighted up to 66,900 pounds. According to VersatileAg.com, the base list price for a 620DT tractor in model year 2024 is $882,667 when it's equipped with 30 inch wide Camso tracks. The 36 inch wide Camso tracks raise the cost of the tractor to $901,192. Customers can further equip this tractor 
with a PTO at a cost of $28,865, and a three-point hitch can be added for an additional cost of $27,678. The Versatile Fury was introduced by the company in model year 2018 and remains a current product in 2024. It is manufactured alongside the company's high horsepower tractors in Winnipeg, Manitoba. There are four models available ranging from 25 to 40 feet. In this video, we're taking a look at the HS350, which is the 35 foot model. It is built with 895 pound feet per disc. It has a drawbar horsepower requirement of 10 to 17 horsepower per foot and has a working depth that can be set from two and a half to five inches. Versatile recommends operating the HS350 Fury at five to 12 miles per hour. It comes standard with 22 inch blades and can be upgraded to optional 24 inch blades. The blades are set at 10 inches apart and with a front and a rear set, they are positioned to leave a five inch space which provides a full cut as it runs through residue across the field. Customers can choose between three different finishing attachments, a 24-inch cage roller with solid bars, a 24-inch spring roller, or a 21.3-inch rubber roller to provide and create a nice firm seed bed. According to Versatile's website, the base list price for an HS350 Fury high-speed disc for model year 2024 is $228,391. I'm up in the cab of the Versatile 620 Delta Track, and we're rolling across the field here with the Fury. So, how fast are you able to pull this? Uh, it likes it around 13, 15 mile an hour. I pulled it 15 one time going downhill just to see if it made a difference, but it genuinely works pretty good at 13, I found. It sure does. It's uh, chopping those stocks up, dislodging the roots. And it's actually Good job in my opinion. So, nice smooth ride too. Yeah, it's a plug track. I normally ride good. Here we can see the tractor coming to the end of the field and nice and tight turning. The click of a button, auto guidance takes over. Jump right back up to 13 miles per hour. So this tractor has a pretty nice cab too, a lot of a lot of room. I will say this is the biggest tractor cab I think I've ever been in. Oh. It's got a nice uh, smooth ride too where this field's been pretty rough today. It's just yeah. gliding over it. We can see the cab is very nice. It's got a two-stage mirror. You can see down there in those tracks and the implement as we turn as well as a rear view and just lots of visibility. So the controls pretty easy, uh, easy to shift and... I mean, very self-explanatory. I mean, simple, just forward for forward, neutral and reverse, and up and down your throttle. It's about as simple as it gets. And all your hydraulics are nice and easily accessible. I like that it shows you on a monitor so you can kind of check on your remotes. Like I know one and two is in float for the folding, so it conquers the ground better with the high speed disc. Some tractors you can't see that on the monitor. No. It's a nice feature in my opinion. That's very really nice, especially when it's dusty and you can't quite see back there. Yeah, you never know what's going on.
When it's time to move on to the next field, this 35-foot wide tillage implement folds up to a narrow 11 feet 10 inches wide and 13 feet 5 inches tall. I hope that you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field and up in the cab with this versatile 620 Delta Track tractor working on fall tillage with the versatile HS350 high speed disc. I would like to hear in the comment section below this video if you use versatile tractors on your farm. Tell me about the model that you're running and the implements that it operates. If you have appreciated this presentation, I hope you'll consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there's over 3,000 videos of farm machines in action. As always, thank you for watching.